In this video, we're going to talk briefly about uh, picking the correct inequality symbol uh, when working out probability questions. So let me just call this useful, useful stuff. So this typically applies like when you're doing binomial problems or Poisson problems. So say someone says that um, x is at least 2. So at least 2. So if you have at least two, that means you have two or more. So the symbol is greater than or equal to. So at least two means greater than or equal to. If you have at most two, at most two, that's less than or equal to. Okay, so less than or equal to two. So at most two is, is less than or equal to. Exactly two, okay, exactly two, that means you have exactly two, so equal to two. So exactly is equals, keyword is equals. More than is pretty easy, but let's write it for completeness. So if you have more than two, that would be greater than two. Less than two is less than two. I'll, I'll write it, less than two is less than two. Okay, less than two is less than two. Greater than two is also this one here. This is also greater than. Um, what else? Oh, fewer than two is the same thing as less than two. If you say two or fewer, that's less than or equal to two, right? Two or fewer is, is less than or equal to two. Um, no more than two. Someone says no more than two. You probably won't see this one, but why not? Just for completeness. So if you can't have more than two, the most you can have is two. So two or less, so less than or equal to two. Um, so at least, at most, more than, greater than, exactly. These are the, typically the ones you see. Every once in a while you'll see stuff like this, but most of the time um, it's these. Hope that helps.